Hello everyone. One of the great new features of PTC Creo 3.0 is the enhanced integration of PTC Creo Parametric with PTC MathCAD. Users will now have the ability to integrate a PTC MathCAD worksheet directly inside a PTC Creo Parametric part or assembly. They will also be able to seamlessly read and write parameters bidirectionally within the worksheet itself. Integrating a PTC MathCAD worksheet directly inside a PTC Creo part or assembly means embedding it within the PTC Creo model. As you see in this example, we embed a MathCAD worksheet directly in the crankshaft assembly. This means that the PTC MathCAD worksheet goes where the model goes. It is saved in the same file. This is very useful when you are working with a multitude of different parts or files or working with a PDM system such as Windchill. In this example, we have a pre-made MathCAD worksheet with a predefined problem statement, goals, requirements, and equations that will attempt to, so to solve our problem. As you can see, we are missing some key pr parameters that we will need to acquire from our Creo model. Once integrated, specific parameters within the MathCAD worksheet can be tagged as inputs and pulled from our model. Additionally, we can also assign outputs from our worksheet and push the data into our Creo model, which we will show in a little bit. Once the worksheet is saved, those parameters become available in the parameter table of the PTC Creo model, and then can be used to either send model data to the worksheet or send worksheet data to the model. In this demonstration, we are saving specific measurements and finding appropriate relations to send back to our MathCAD spreadsheet based on the inputs we were assigned. Right now we are looking for the diameter of the bore of the piston and the radius of the crankshaft. Once we have located the specific properties we need, we can assign them to our input variables in the relation table. Integration between MathCAD and Creo has two main use cases, both of which are demonstrated in this example. The first being analysis-driven design. This is when the comprehensive math functionality of the embedded PTC MathCAD worksheet is used to define parameters which are then pushed to the PTC Creo model to use in geometry or simulation. The second is verification and validation. This is when parameters from the model itself are sent to the worksheet to be validated against some predefined set of equations to ensure they fit within whatever criteria they need to adhere to. Engineering calculations play a crucial role in all stages of product development and PTC MathCAD has been the leading engineering calculation software for more than 20 years. As you can see in the demonstration, we have solved our problem and found a logical solution. We can then take that data and push it back into the Creo model. Inside the Creo model, we can grab the new data and assign them to specific measurements or parameters. In result, the model will adapt to the new data and can be regenerated creating a new, optimized model. This is a great example of how you can use MathCAD to verify and validate your working parameters and additionally drive your design analytically. 